Welcome to this Fix It channel and today we're going to take a look at uh, um, a little problem that people have and how to actually download updates, Windows updates manually using the Microsoft Update Catalog. Now Windows updates, when they go well, they go well and that's cool and usually they install through the update process of your computer. But it can happen that a update will get stuck. It doesn't want to install, it doesn't want to work. What do you do? Well, you can actually install updates manually when they fail to update uh, automatically through Windows Update. To do that, you will need to use the Microsoft Update Catalog. One little thing that you need to know is that, the, you know, it's one of those very weird and idiot things that Microsoft sometimes does. The Microsoft Update Catalog only works in Internet Explorer 11, so you cannot use any other browsers to go there. By the way, the um, URL for the update catalog, which is catalog.update.microsoft.com, will be in the description below the video. So now, what do you need to know to download the correct update? Well, in Windows 7, of course, you will see that your Windows updates, what, it, what failed. Uh, in Windows 8, Windows uh, also. In Windows 10, you've got the uh, information also on the updates that will have failed. What you need to know when an update gets stuck is which one has a problem installing. Each update has a catalog number, which is that KB number. KB3189866, for example, is the one that I have the latest. Uh, KB3188128, and so on. You need to know that number because that's how you will search for an update. Say that I had a problem installing a cumulative update for Windows 10 version 60.07 here, KB3176938. Well, all I have to do is go into the update catalog and type KB317, I believe it's 6938, 6938. I'll click the search button. And here I've got cumulative update for Windows 10 um, KB6938. Notice there are two versions. There's a version X64 and a version which is the 32-bit version. So you need to know which version you will need. So for any type of updates, you'll need to search on this list because sometimes there's multiple operating systems. So you'll have to search the version for what version of Windows you have. Uh, what version of Windows 10, for example, also that you have, so 16.07 with the anniversary update or 15.11 November and so on. So you have to choose the correct version. Once that is done, what you do is you click the Add button and it will appear in the View Basket. There you will click the View Basket, you will click Download. It's going to ask you where you want to download it, so you'll click Browse. And I'll say, for example, desktop, I'll click OK, I'll click continue. And then you'll see there's a download of the Windows update in progress. So for example, that's one, I will actually stop this one, but I already have one in my desktop that I downloaded earlier. So once you go on your desktop, you will see a folder called security update for, so the one that I downloaded for was uh, Flash Player. The, you see here the other one is a cumulative update for Windows 10, 16, 11. They all download into folders and these folders contain the executable file that you can click and install the update on your PC. <coughs> Chances are you'll be able to uh, install most updates that didn't go through in the Windows update. So that's one way that you can actually manual install, manually install updates. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe to my channel. You'll be informed when new videos are online. Give us thumbs up. And thank you so much for watching our channel.